Hey, what's up? It's Christine Horn. This is Actors Daily Bread, where I teach you how to crush your auditions, book more work, and live a life that you love. I am Christine Horn, professional working actress of 20 plus years and life and career coach for actors just like you. I'm live on Instagram. What's up, Instagram? I see you, Sam. <laughs> What's up, Facebook? I'm here as well. So listen, this is episode 160, 160 of Actors Daily Bread. So I'm super excited that I've we have this many episodes. If you're new to me, I want to welcome you to all my replay watchers who will watch this later. What's up, replay watchers? Love you guys. So today I want to talk about not waiting until the last minute, okay? And I also have two, uh, two very important announcements, two things I want to share with you guys today that only my Hollywood Bound actor community is going to be aware of. So first of all, hey, 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 happy Tuesday here. I know for those of you on the East Coast, it's getting kind of late, you're settling down. Hey, Charity. Hey, Carl. Hey, Roxanne. Hey, Anumel. So I want to talk about waiting to the last minute because something happened to me today that just reinforced something that I always say, but got reinforced for me personally. So you know you get a, you get a, a self-tape uh, assignment, right? So we're not talking about the in-person. We're talking about you get a self-tape invite. What's up, you guys? And it says, so let's say today is Tuesday. It's due Friday. It's due, let's say it's due Thursday, 9 a.m., right? So you're like, okay, I got to Thursday, 9 a.m. That's what you think, but it's, it is Tuesday night. Theoretically, you could get it done, uh, before Thursday at nine, but you know, sometimes we wait and like, oh, what's for me? What's my husband's work schedule? If he's not available, well, do I have a self tape place? All that stuff. Hey, Debrika, hey, Renor, I see you, right? So here's the thing I know we've heard this, and I know I've said this to you before, and I want you to stick around because I do have an announcement tonight. And for those of you on Facebook, it's in the description. Um, when you submit early, there are some casting directors who will stop look to several things will happen. Some will stop looking. They're like, oh, found it. Oh, Roxanne is amazing. Roxanne is amazing. Sharon is amazing. Lenny is amazing. We can stop looking further. I'm gonna go ahead and send this tape over to producers, let them to see it and they can make a decision. Boom, boom, we done. We don't have to keep looking through hundreds of tapes because why? We have other things to cast, other roles to cast for this episode. That's one major thing that can happen, right? So another thing that can happen is, okay, for our example, you got the audition tonight. It's right. It's for those of you on the East Coast, it's at almost 10 o'clock. Um, for me out here, it's like six something. So it happened to me the other day. I rushed. I was like, I knew my schedule was going to be so busy. I just got back from Bermuda. I just got back from vacation, trying to shake off the vacation mode. And I was like, if I don't do this audition tonight, even though it's not due for another day or so, I'm not going to get to it. Between coaching, acting, my acting clients, my own auditions, driving all over God's creation in California, I was like, I'm not going to do it. So I sent it early. And it was late. My husband's looking at me with a side eye because it's his night off. <laughs> Anybody who got a spouse doing their tapes with them knows about their side eye or even just a mate, right? Okay, the wig is acting up. There we go. Get right. Right? So we rush and do it. And then today I get a call. I'm not going to disclose what it is naturally. But they were like, the casting director sent notes and said, we love it. We would love for her to do it again. And they sent notes because technically... Again, it's not due till, for our case, it's technically not due till Thursday, right? For the example that we're using today. So if I had waited until the last minute, Carl says, me, <laughs> if I had waited until the last minute, I wouldn't even have had an opportunity to get those notes to retape. And see, the, what's tricky about self-tapes, what I love about them and what I hate about them is that we're not in the room. So some of you dread self-tapes. I really love them, but what sucks is you're not in the room to get redirected, which is why for a lot of my private clients, shout out to all of you and all of you in the Booking Magnet Academy, I'm always saying send another tapes. Unless they say don't send another take, I always suggest doing another take because you're not in the room. So I just want to plant this seed for you also to get it done as soon as possible. And I know you're working jobs. Some of y'all got kids. You're married. Just to schedule, you already have three other auditions. But this is when it's really important to compartmentalize what needs to get done when. Because for me, I have to. I, it's hard for me to work on three auditions at once. I actually don't. I'll print them all out, have them highlighted, 
but I have to get one done before I move on. Like, and so even if it's in person, I still have to compartmentalize how I'm gonna do it and when I'm gonna study it and what space in my brain it can take. So if you're lucky and blessed enough to get a self tape that you can tape, get out of the way, move on, I'm telling you to do it because that casting director is gonna either pick you to move on quicker and stop looking and or send you back with some notes to retape so that you can still make the original deadline so that they can make their deadline, okay? Before, I'm gonna give you one more bonus tip tonight, but before I do, I do wanna share this announcement because I know it's late for some of you. Um, hey, Trafina, I see you there. Hey, Madison. Um, so listen, in case you haven't heard, I am coming to Atlanta, Georgia this summer, August 24th for the Bronze Lens Film Festival. And I'm so excited. I'm going to be teaching all day an event called Level Up to Stardom. I'm really excited about it. And what the Bronze Lens team has done, especially for my community, so that's you, 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 is they've given us, they've given me, us, a discount code exclusively for my community. So exclusively for my Hollywood bound actor community. So if you're on Facebook, just look at the links below. You'll see that um, discount code. It's only valid until August 1st. It is a 10% off coupon exclusively for my community. So if you wanna come, grab it. Can't say I didn't tell you so. They're doing this exclusively for us. For those of you on Instagram, the link is in my bio to connect to the website to buy uh, access to that event. But I wanna just say it out loud so that you can have it. And I'll post it somewhere soon, but just for the sake of tonight. It's 19, as in the year, right? 19, B L F F H B one nine B L F F as in bronze lens film festival and then H B as in Hollywood bound. And I know you got it. One nine B L F F H B one nine B L F F H B. That's a little insight into how I used to study for school tests. <laughs> I made everything a song. Oh gosh. Um, so I'm really, really excited about that. And if you're new to me, again, this is episode 160 of Actors Daily Bread. You can catch up on YouTube. There are over 160 episodes of goodness. Some of you reach out to me, you DM me. How can I get this? How can I get this? Now, listen, don't email me asking me what episode has what, because I've talked so much, I don't remember. Just go watch them. And if you want to get a free five-part training series from me about self-taping and things you need, tech, how to work the camera, go to bookmorework.com. Those of you on Facebook, it's just right there in the, in the description, bookmorework.com or Instagram. Just click the link in my bio. There's all kinds of good stuff there. The last tip I just want to give you is um, about just about auditioning and taping in general. I think sometimes not sometimes, oftentimes, as performers, as artists, we're very sensitive. Um, hi, Miss, I'm never gonna try to say it. I see your comment though. Instagram, y'all got these names. I can't even say them. <laughs> I just wanna say this, as actors, and I just finished coaching with several clients today, I know it's frustrating, me included, okay? If bookings have slowed up, um, have slowed down, excuse me, and when things, the momentum doesn't feel like it's meeting your desire, right? And I also know what it's like when our friends are booking more than us, right? They're in different seasons and we want to celebrate them. But then there's still that part of you that's like, you know, why not me? When's my turn? I just want to really invite you to remember every audition, every audition, every opportunity you have to create and perform, whether it is a commercial audition, uh, something you're doing for theater, Broadway, film, it doesn't matter. It's an opportunity for you to share your gifts with the world. You've been blessed with the gift. Not everybody has your gift. And so if we remember that we are blessed with a gift that the world needs to see and any opportunity we get to share it is a blessing and that we really need to cherish that and really be aware of what we're putting out into the world. Every audition I have, every self-tape I have, this represents Christine Horn, the brand. And then for me, it goes deeper, it represents me, it represents my mom, it represents my mentors and my teachers and my guides and the people who have supported me. So I do them all a disservice by feeling like, oh, it's just another whatever, oh, it's just whatever. Like, no, this is my gift, this is my opportunity to share with the world what I do. And so we can get so caught up in, I didn't book that. She booked it. He booked it. Dang, was my turn. But it's like, I got a chance to play five different characters this week. Yeah, I might have put 100 miles in my car in one day. That's fine. <laughs> but I think 
and I talk to myself about this, not losing sight of the why, why you started. I always go back to that. I always go back to that. So I wanted to just pop on, say hello, send you all some love, give you those huge announcements because I'm gonna, I really wanna make sure my Hollywood Bound Actors community who was able to make it to Atlanta this summer, some of you are probably already planning on attending the film festival. And if you are, um, that's just an added bonus, but I'm really looking forward to teaching and sharing everything that we do there. If you want to know more about what it looks like to work with me, just click the link anywhere you see here. And this, just get on my mailing list, get some of the trainings, go to my YouTube channel. And when you're ready to invest at a higher level, you can we can reach out and talk about that then. But until then, just soak it all up and keep sharing your gift because the world needs to see it. Talk to you guys later. I'm Christine Horn. See you next time. Bye. Bye, Instagram. Bye.